Hey guys, thanks for tuning back in. So this is another really janky deck tech. And when I say janky, I mean this is this is really janky. I, I nicknamed the deck Silly Lily. I mean, come on. All right, just to give you an idea of how janky it is. So yeah, this is not going to win you tournaments, but it will go infinite. It's just a matter of time before this thing goes infinite. It requires a lot of pieces of the puzzle to make it work. It, it is probably the most difficult combo I've ever pulled off, okay? So I'm just going to get into the deck right now and explain how it works a little bit, and then I'll get into some gameplay. So first up, we got Raise Dead. Uh, return target creature card from your graveyard to your hand. Basically, this card exists just to get Metallic Mimic back into our hand because it's one of the key pieces of the deck. Next up, we have Chart a Course. Uh, draw a few cards and discard a card unless you attack with the creature this turn. We just need to get cards in our hand base. We need to get the right cards. Search for Ascanta. Right, we are searching for something, and that's why Search for Ascanta is in here. We're going to have three of those. Strategic planning. We're running a total of four strategic planners. Uh, again, look at the top three cards of your library. Put one of them into your hand, the rest into your graveyard. Again, just need some cards. Seeker Squire, same thing, but at least we have a chump block out there for a turn or something. When Seeker Squire enters the battlefield, it explores. Sure, why not? Uh, Metallic Mimic. This is a... Uh, one of the key pieces is Metallic Mimic, and uh, what he is going to do is allow uh, a little combination or interaction with Liliana. So when our creature hits the battlefield, uh, our Ballista, it's a 1 1. It doesn't just die. That's the purpose of this. So we'll get to it in a second. Four copies Arcane Adaption, uh, another key piece of the puzzle. <laughs> There's a lot of keys here. As you guys know, as Arcane Adaption enters the battlefield, choose a creature type. Creatures you control are the chosen type in addition to their other types. Uh, the same is true for creature spells you control and creature cards you own that aren't on the battlefield. Yeah, we're going to name zombies when this sucker hits. And we'll get into that in one sec. Champion of Wits, because we, we need to do some digging. There's only three copies of this because it's an enchantment. Usually these are more difficult to remove, a lot more difficult to remove than, for instance, a creature. So that's why we're only running three copies. So we're going to do a lot of digging. We'll get to this card, you know. It just, it'll just happen. Champion of Wits definitely will help us draw the cards we need. Uh, it's a three-drop. You guys, it's, it's just a great card draw ability. We all know Champion of Wits. Uh, four Lilianas, Untouched by Death. This is another... You have to have this card as well. <laughs> like I said, it's very complex. It's, it's a lot going on here. For four... Okay, this thing gets the plus one. Put the top three cards of your library into your graveyard. If at least one of them is a zombie a zombie card, each opponent loses two life and you gain two life. Okay, cool. That helps a little bit. Minus two, target creature gets minus X, minus X. It's one of turn racks the number of zombies you control. We're probably never going to use that. Uh, it's minus three. You may cast zombie cards from your graveyard this turn. That is what we want to go with. That minus three loyalty counters. That is going to get us our victory or our combo. Two Vraska's Contempt, at least we can destroy something out there uh, with this deck. That's why it's there. <laughs> the Scarab God, uh, just because, hey, sometimes maybe we'll get crazy and we actually win this sucker. And we have Scarab God in the deck. Four Walking Ballistas, another piece of that combo, okay? So this is the main one. Walking Ballista, it don't matter if he's in our graveyard. It really doesn't matter. Oh, and by the way, I believe where I saw this was uh, a deck... Uh, a gentleman did on TCG Player on their channel, I believe. I think that's where I came across this deck initially. But I want, but they didn't demonstrate the deck and how how it actually like how it wins. No, no one has footage of this, so I decided to to make the video to demonstrate and show the footage of the deck actually going in or going infinite. Okay. All right. So how the combo works: Walking Ballista could be in the graveyard or he could be in our hand. Doesn't really matter. Um, we need to have Liliana untouched by death out um, with the you may cast zombie cards from your graveyard this turn. Arcane Adaption has to be out because we're going to have zombies being named. Metallic Mimic has to be on the battlefield. Zombies have to be named. So they're going to get a plus one, plus one counter whenever they hit the battlefield. Okay. Walking Ballista would enter the battlefield as a zombie. Right. When he comes out, or when we get him from our graveyard, we can. you may cast zombie cards from our graveyard. We will cast them from our graveyard. So Walking Ballista would come out from the graveyard. We can cast it because he's a zombie now, thanks to our arcane 
adaptation. Once he hits the battlefield, he gets plus one, plus one. We are just going to use that plus one, plus one counter. We're going to just get rid of it. We're just going to minus one, minus one him right away. We're going to remove that plus one, plus one counter and deal one damage to our opponent. All right, enough of me flapping my jaw. This thing goes into the graveyard, and then it comes right back because we can cast it from our graveyard because it's going to cost us nothing. It's XX. We just choose to pay zero, and it enters as a 1-1. One, one. That's how it goes down. There's no sideboard, no need for it. We're just trying to get this thing to go off. So let's just get into it. And pardon me for being a little quiet in this video. You'll see the gameplay. My son was in the room next to me sleeping. I didn't want to wake him up. It was kind of late. All right, let's do this. Oh, and make sure you thumbs up. And if you're not subscribed by now, please do. Let's see if we can pull this off. one thing, it's not going to be easy. Yeah, I gotta cast it. Gotta do something. I mean, this is really, really jank. It, uh, <laughs> it doesn't take much for this to fail. This is probably the ultimate glass cannon. Just feared. I'm respected. Well, they aren't useful to me alive. We're gonna need a mimic. We need a mimic. And, uh. Walking ballista. We need a mimic in our hand, though. We need a mimic on the battlefield and a ballista in the graveyard. I, mean, I can always get the ballista to the graveyard. Please, baby, please. <laughs> Wait till you see what I've got planned oh, for you. Nothing. Mm, I should have done charter course. Darn it.
we can possibly get this next turn. I cannot lose Metallic Mimic, though. Oof. If he ends up countering this right now, well, we can bring him back. It was Ray's dead. Oh my, next turn we got it. If he doesn't remove anything, this will be insane. I think we got it. Sorry, I'm oh late. God, no Let's way. skip to the good part. No way. No way. Okay. I have mastered death. Oh, we did it. it again. Hey. There we go. It's infinite. It's infinite. Oh my god, it's so funny. too funny this is too funny you put a good game he knows what we did <laughs> come on how cool is that it just keeps coming back again and again and again that is so cool He'd be nice enough to at least sit here and let me do it to him for a little bit. This is too funny. Alright, let's pump it up. Whoops, I think I need to pay him like two. Yeah, I made a mistake. So this is how you go infinite <laughs> in standard. Oh man. It's a, it's a slow, agonizing pain for that, but it works. painful. <laughs> Come on, this is funny. <laughs> oh man. I'm just happy we pulled it off because it's not easy. This was my fourth attempt, so it took four tries to be able to get this to go. And basically, we needed someone with no removal and no counter spells in order for it to work. So, I appreciate Trey28040 for hanging out while we finish up this combo and 
Yeah, that's funny. Pretty neat, though. Walked away. I know I would. <sighs> oh, finally quiet. So cool. So cool. Alright, guys. I appreciate you tuning into this one. Um, thumbs up the video because if you enjoyed it if you thought it was fun uh i appreciate it all right pla